what we learned against Sweden was that this uh, journey is not going to be easy. And, um, you know, we need to stay together as a, as a unit um, and stay focused on the goal at hand. And that's, and that's winning this whole thing, winning the World Cup. Our, our mindset going into Brazil is to just get, uh, go after them, believe in our attack, stay disciplined in our attack, um, and exploit what Brazil opens up. The strengths we have against Brazil are that we're more disciplined, uh, we're going to stay together as a team unit, and we're going to score goals against them. Uh, Yankees a little bit, yep. Um, Derek Jeter's quest for 3,000 hits is what? <laughs> Derek Jeter's quest for 3,000 hits is very inspiring. Why? <laughs> um, because, it, it, you know, he's shown an incredible persistence. Um, uh, not only in his, you know, journey for an individual statistic, but, um, you know, he's been a team leader for, for years and years. So uh, it, it impresses me always to read articles about him and to hear him speak about his team. Sure. Okay. That's okay. Dave wants to know, will there be any tactical changes on defense to cope with Brazil? Um, I think uh, in terms of tactical changes, um, I think that we're going to stay as a cohesive unit, um, but just be aware, uh, a little bit more aware of obviously their personality players. Um, but I think, you know, in terms of our back line, uh, we're going to stay in, as a cohesive unit. No worries. No problem. I think we're going to bounce back from this loss um, like we already have in the last two days by focusing on what's ahead. Um, we've already forgotten about the Sweden game, you know, taking some positives from it. Uh, but to be honest, we've completely left it in the past and uh, moving on to the quarterfinals. So. Uh, I think that's what you have to do as a professional, and that's what you have to do when your main goal is to win the entire tournament. Derek Jeter's quest for 3,000 hits is very inspiring because, it, it, you know, he's shown an incredible persistence, um, uh, not only in his, you know, journey for an individual statistic, but, um, you know, he's been a team leader for, for years and years. So uh, it, it impresses me always to read articles about him and to hear him speak about his team.